Any machine learning engineer understands that for virtually every machine learning problem, there are multiple models that you can use. But each machine learning model comes with its own trade-offs. The challenge isn't just training a model, it is selecting the right one for a specific use case. So, how do we know which model is most suitable for the task at hand? To address that, I've developed a simple yet practical application that helps you select a machine learning model based on three factors. The type of the problem that you're trying to solve, whether it's a classification, a regression, or a clustering problem. The size of the dataset, is it a small, medium, or large? Or whether interpretability is a priority for your project. So this app will help you balance predictive power, transparency, practicability, depending on your project goals. So you have, in this case, uh, the types of classification, regression, clustering, recommendation, NLPs, and time series. For classification, we usually use classification when we want to predict a label or a category from a predefined set of classes. So that is when you want a discrete app output. Examples of problems that you can solve using classification are spam detection or disease prediction. Regression. We usually use regression when we want to, to predict a continuous numeric value, a real number output. For example, you want to predict the price or you want to forecast sales. Clustering. We usually use clustering when we want to group similar data points together without any labeled outcomes. Remember, clustering is an unsupervised learning model. So the example that you can use clustering for is customer segmentation or image seg image segmentation. Um, if you want, if you want to, if you have a recommendation problem, uh, when you want to predict things like user preference or recommend items to them, such as what YouTube does, what Amazon, Netflix does, uh, you can use this model for such problems as that. Um, NLP, natural language processing. When you are working with text or speech data to extract meaning, insights, or make predictions, you always have to use NLPs. So problems that you may solve using NLPs are sentiment analysis and text classification. And lastly, time series. When you want to work with data index over time and want to predict future values, for example, you want to predict uh, stock prices in the future, future energy consumptions, you can you have to always use time series. So let's say, for example, I want I have a, a regression prob problem and my data size is large and I want to have uh, interpretability set to yes. So this um, app will always recommend you three best model with feature selection. I will change one more time. Let's say I have an NLP problem and I have a medium data set and I will set interpretability uh, on yes, recommended model. It will give me TensorFlow and uh, plus logistic regression and naive bias. So thank you, check it out and I'll keep on improving this model so that you can check it out and also use it for day-to-day -day machine learning problems. Cheers and bye-bye.